Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and today I'm gonna show you how to fix the error unknown URL scheme on Windows 11 in no time. Now the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to disable the Chrome extensions. To do this, open up your default Chrome browser, then head over to the ellipsis in the top right corner or the three dots, then hover over extensions and click on manage extensions. Now what you have to do in here is disable all the extensions one by one. Afterwards, you can restart Chrome and check if the error still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to clear Chrome cookies and cache. Now to do this, open up your Chrome browser, then click on the three dots in the top right corner, then select history and afterwards click on the history tab. Now what you have to do in here is select clear browsing data on the left pane and afterwards make sure to choose a time range Possibly delete all time to avoid any suspicious files, then also select the cookies and other site data and then click on the clear data button. Now you can restart Chrome and check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to disable the firewall. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type firewall and then select Windows Defender Firewall from the search results. Now in here, on the left pane, click on the Turn Windows Defender Firewall on or off option and make sure to turn off Windows Defender Firewall for both private network settings and public network settings. Now click on Apply and OK to save the changes, restart your PC and check if the problem still persists. And the last solution is to turn off hardware acceleration on Google Chrome. Now to do this, open up your default Chrome browser, then click on the three dot menu in the top right corner and select the settings option. Now in here on the left pane, click on system and afterwards make sure to turn off hardware acceleration even when it's available option. From here on, just close Chrome and restart the application to check if the problem still persists. And that's it, super simple, isn't it? Of course, if this video helped you, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more quality content. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.